Hi, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 26th, 27th, 28th, 29th, maybe. We're just going to see what comes up. All right, so yeah. I'm going to start my Aprils next, and I am going to do one for every sign, at least one for every sign. Um, so stay tuned for that. What do we have for a message today? Well, we had some go flying off the table. All right. I got them. I've only seen the top one yet because they landed like this. And they landed like that, so I don't know what the ones are underneath. But tankered, celebration, fun, enjoyment. It could be drinks. I had to get them with this. I went far. Good old handy tool. Dog is sideways. Protection from a powerful friend. So there's protection from a powerful friend. Maybe it's coming in. This one's reversed. Claw, be careful. Do not take risks. Maybe it's time to take a risk. Maybe somebody's going to be taking a risk. Um, maybe it's time to have some fun. I thought there was four of them, but I guess not. Oh, I just looked on the bottom. Carriage, a journey, either physical or mental. So... Celebration, fun, enjoyment. Maybe it's time to take a risk. Let your guard down. There is protection, though, because dogs are, you know, usually guard dogs. Dogs are, they alert you of everything that's going on. That's for darn sure. Anyhow, a journey, either physical or mental. Whatever has happened or is happening is part of your journey. Time to celebrate by the looks of things. I mean, that's what it looks like anyway, but we shall see. Those went flying off the table, though, in a hurry. And they were, they went far, okay? They went really far. Okay. Woo! Oh, wow. The universe is at work here. This is major, all right? This is big. This is really big. It's time for a change. Definitely time for a change, okay? There's no doubt about that. Now, the tower reversed. I wonder if there's been a loss, a permanent loss. There's been a loss. There's been upheaval. There's Maybe it's time to accept the new era, accept the new life. Okay, this is like a, a traumatic event that has probably already happened that changes everything. Okay, everything changes. All right, so huh. it's time to rebuild. It's time to build a new foundation. That's exactly what this is. It's time for something better. It's, you know, it is. Um, timing is everything. Timing is everything. Is it, We have a new purpose. Something, it's time. It's some something about divine timing. The universe is at work. You can't avoid this. Don't avoid it. Try not, do not avoid it. It's time. It's time to mingle or it's time to get together. It's very interesting. It is. And, it, and it's interesting that it was a sudden fall, you know, the cards went flying. Suddenly, I said that, that's the tower. Now, this is extremes. Both of these can represent extremes. Oh, expect the unexpected. Expect the unexpected. It's time to build a new foundation as far as I'm concerned. Everything changes. There could be a fall that leads to something better. 
Temperance is a card of healing. It is. It's an energy of healing, healing, and healing from some sort of loss. Hmm. Healing from some sort of loss. This is definitely a loss. The Six of Wands reverses loss. It's losing a battle. It's losing at the game. It's not winning. Maybe it's time to heal. Maybe it's time to compromise. Temperance is a compromise. It really is to achieve balance and harmony. Now, it has something to do with moderation and accepting and allowing. So there's acceptance and allowance here that it was this disruption or this loss maybe was part of the plan, right? It was part of your purpose. It was part of your evolution, right? Anyhow, we have healing from a loss. I mean, I can't. It is what it is. The Six of Wands reversed is somebody that could be a one-hit wonder. This could be somebody that is very egotistical, sits on a very high horse, leads others in the wrong direction, doesn't care. You know, this is somebody that leaves a man behind, you know. I'm the boss. All that matters is me. This is not a good leader, okay? This is somebody that doesn't lead others in the right direction. This is somebody that follows the pack, follows the crowd, uh, doesn't have good intentions, doesn't act in a noble manner. So somebody could be literally losing some sort of battle because of their inability to lead or their inability to do the right thing. The Six of Wands in reverse is somebody that lacks self-confidence, for one, which causes them to do things that maybe aren't the right thing to do to gain some sort of ego boost, right? That's what this person is. This person, I don't know, somebody's losing support or they're losing their people, maybe because they, they sit on a very high horse. They're very, very cocky, you know? It's my way or the highway type of energy. Um, three of Swords reversed is healing. You know, this is healing. It's let, leaving something behind. It's things starting to get better. It may be forgiving or letting bygones be bygones. The, the temperance card is acceptance. It's acceptance that there's a false sense of security here. You know, maybe somebody is letting go of a false, false sense of security to have something better. Now, there could be a fall, though, because a tower can be a permanent loss. It can be a health issue. Um, it can be an internal disruption, external disruption. Everything changes. A foundation is changing. It's time. You may be surprised. Seven of Cups reverse. Seven of Cups reverse is becoming clear. Coming out of confusion. Coming out of illusion. Becoming clear of a choice. Making a choice. I see clearly now. You know. So making a choice. This choice has been avoided. It has been. But it's time to stop avoiding it and make a choice. It's almost like this choice can no longer be avoided. Or somebody's making a choice. This choice has to do with balance. It has to do with harmony. It has to do with receiving and giving. Ace of Cups reversed. So somebody may be sad right now. There could be an emotional loss. Um, emotions all over the place. This is in the right now position. So right now there's there could be emotional withdrawal, emotional shutdown, tears, sadness, um, emptiness here. Some something could have happened suddenly, or it's happening suddenly now. Could be a change of heart. Somebody is seeing something very clearly about 
a foundation. Maybe it's not love. It's very interesting considering the uh, quote I put at the uh, beginning of this reading. I, I did it about 45 minutes ago. There's false love. Maybe somebody has been protecting themselves from getting hurt again as well. Because we have the protection, then we have the tower, which is walls, right? Breaking down those walls. So somebody's walls may be coming down. There's been a lack of love. Anyhow, where are we at now? Mm. Justice reverse. Justice reverse is an injustice. It's unfair treatment, lack of integrity, not telling the truth. Um, an imbalance, okay, not doing the right thing. Dishonesty, somebody may have been dishonest with themselves, not even, you know, listening to their heart as well, not listening to their intuition. There's dishonesty here, justice reverse is unfair, this is, this is not fair, it's an injustice, it's an imbalance, there's lies here. An injustice is being seen. Towers false. Justice reversed is lies. Seven of Cups reversed is it's all very clear. It's all very clear. There's indecision. There has been anyway. Confusion and illusion. There's been some serious illusion. Ooh, six of wands up right now. So this is a hero, right? Now we have a hero. We have a soldier. We have a veteran. Somebody that does the right thing. Leads others out of battle. Leads others to safety. Right? This is victory after a battle, victory after sorrow. And the sorrow is the Ace of Cups reversed that is right before it. So yeah, I mean, there's victory after sorrow, so there's victory after a loss. This is a congratulations card. It's time for a shift. I feel like it's a power shift. Now the tower may have to do with institutions, governments, um, could have to do with relationships. It's a foundation that is unstable, that was built on lies, built on deception. There's been a lot of confusion. There's been a lot of insincerity, I gotta say, with justice reversed. Somebody's been very unclear. They've been letting their emotions control their decisions rather in their emotions have been leading them backwards in the wrong direction. It's time to take charge. It's time to go and go. Okay, that six of wands, the battle is over, done fighting, done playing, done ignoring, done ignoring. So somebody's all done ignoring something, ignoring their feelings or not being loved maybe. The, the justice reverse is not getting what one deserves. Take a look at that quote at the beginning of this reading. I can't remember what it says. Um, something about what you deserve. Love is getting the love that you deserve. Um, hold on. This is about getting the love that you deserve. We accept the love we think we deserve. Came to me out of the blue. Somebody has been confused about the love that they deserve. Huh? That is sad. 
when you don't even know what you deserve. You deserve stability. You deserve to be protected. Six of Wands in the upright is a protector. The Six of Wands in the reverse is not. Now you can choose to let somebody be in your life that doesn't care about you. That doesn't protect you. That wants attention from everybody else but you. Or you can choose to be with somebody that is noble. That will protect you. That will fight for you. The Six of Wands in reverse is somebody that will not fight for you. Somebody's been exploring their options. Anyhow, it's time for victory. It's time for success. Oh, Ten of Cups reversed. Ten of Cups reversed is relationship problems. It's, an, it's a dying dream. It's an unhappy family. Could be relationship that is ending. Because it's not love. It's not love. You may have somebody also that's been afraid. They've been afraid. Afraid of what? Afraid of getting hurt again. It's time. It's very clear. There's karma here as well. Somebody's in a relationship that is based on lies. It's not emotionally fulfilling. It's empty. It's There's no love there. I'm, I'm telling you what. It's a false sense of security. It really is. It's a complete illusion. Four of Cups. Not happy. Right? Focusing on a loss, ignoring an opportunity, missing an opportunity, not acknowledging an opportunity. So focused on a loss that, that an opportunity is being missed. It has been missed. The past, something that was done in the past. Maybe it was the injustice of the past or... The confusion, it's the past, something or a false sense, a false foundation or a false sense of security that was held on to in the past has been causing somebody to miss an opportunity. This is, uh, this is an injustice. It really is. It's not fair. Somebody hasn't been getting the love that they deserve. There's an opportunity here. There's definitely an opportunity here. There's a need to master emotions. Like I said, somebody's not been acknowledging the facts okay the justice card has the blindfold on and it's reversed it's like i don't care what the truth is i'm in love i'm in love with this illusion i'm in love with this fantasy i'm in love they're not looking they're not being logical this can also be somebody that's choosing not to even acknowledge an opportunity for love because they were deceived in the past. So this can go multiple ways. They were lied to in the past. They got themselves into a foundation that crumbled. So now they're afraid. Back to that Six of Wands reversed and all these cards. So there's definitely this definitely has to do with love. It has to do with relationships. And it has to do with what you deserve. They basically gave me the message before I turned on his camera. Because I did my intro. And that was the quote that I chose. Injustice is about what you deserve. This happens to be reversed next to the Ace of Cups reversed. Everybody deserves to be loved. Everybody deserves to be loved. Authentically. With somebody that will protect them and take care of them. And somebody that doesn't want to play games. Doesn't need to have support from everybody and their brother or sister. Some, everybody deserves to be loved by somebody that is noble. I 
I do feel like we have somebody here that's turning their them turning their back on a relationship that isn't love because they're realizing they're seeing very clearly that they deserve more. Reciprocation, honesty, communication. Stability. Chariot reversed. Oh my goodness gracious. This is big. Okay. Chariot reversed. This is a stop. This is a halt. This is emotions all over the place. I'm telling you what. Emotions have been driving. Emotions have been... <laughs> The main factor. Emotions. Somebody has been making all of their decisions based off their emotions, their feelings. No logic. We definitely have an injustice here. We have a false sense of security. It's not going anywhere. It's not going anywhere. Uh, stuck, stuck in the past, stuck on a relationship, um, lack of discipline, lack of willpower, lost sight, somebody's lost sight of their goals, they have, they've been stuck, not getting what they deserve, not, and, and, and it feels like we have somebody here that's been really, 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 really confused going backwards missing an opportunity to move forward being stuck stuck in the past stuck stuck there's an opportunity here there's an opportunity here there's an opportunity for love here it's time to realize it's time to admit something we got somebody here doesn't want to accept any accountability they don't want to accept the truth it's time to accept it's time to accept. So something is being accepted or it's going to be accepted. There could be upheaval. There could be a loss that maybe forces somebody. There could be force here. This is a dead end. Okay. The chariot reverse is a dead end. Okay. It's not going anywhere. There's, it's extremely emotional as well. There's something here. This is emotional. Stop lying about the falseness stop lying stop stop this is not love there's an opportunity that you are missing it's time to receive something better something more genuine stop procrastinating stop procrastinating You need to replace your fear with faith as well. It's time to open up. Open up your eyes. Eight of Cups reverse. Somebody's been staying put pretending they're happy. I'm not happy, but I'm going to pretend that I am. This is not moving forward. It's like pretending. It is. There's emotional disappointment, but refusing to walk away, refusing to leave. There's emptiness here. A lot of empty cups, I'll tell you that. Um, not happy, staying put, refusing to move forward, refusing to move on. Really, really sad. This is sad. There could be a sad farewell here. There could be in the very near future. Somebody may be finding there right around the corner is a six of wands. That is somebody that is confident, okay? Taking charge, done going backwards, done playing games, done fighting, game over. Victory after sorrow. So I feel like we have somebody here that has been ignoring 
their intuition. They've been extremely confused, disillusioned. There's been a lot of lies and deceptions. They've been holding on to a false sense of security, completely stuck. Their emotions have caused them these delays and setbacks and all the all this heartache and all this grief. They've been healing, however, even though it's been extremely emotional, there is healing because of the Three of Swords reverse and the Temperance card. It's time. It's time to build a new foundation. It's time to admit something. We have somebody here that has been fighting they have been playing a lot of games. They've been letting their pain and their hurt and their sadness drive. And they may be losing a relationship completely because of it. Get prepared. Three of Wands. The future looks bright. This is where a definite decision is made. Time's up. This is ready to go. Bags packed, ready to go. There could be somebody at a distance here as well. Also, something could be coming back that was sent out a long time ago. Maybe intentions. Maybe if somebody sent intentions out a long time ago, it could be coming back around now. Um... This is a time of decision, creativity, growth. Um, we have somebody here that's ready. They're ready to go. They're ready to expand. They're ready to, to, to take a risk. That's risky. Congratulations. Congratulations. I gotta say that. Six of Wands next to the Three of Wands. Something about hard work as well. So anyhow, um, time's up. Ready to go. The future looks bright. Stepping into new territory with optimism. We have somebody here that is a warrior. This is somebody that is all done playing games. They're ready. They're ready. Maybe they've been healing from a relationship or they've had to evolve. They had to learn some sort of lesson. They've been confused. But I feel like time is definitely, definitely, definitely up. Get prepared. There could be a departure. There could be an arrival here. I feel like we have somebody here that has made a decision to refocus and build a foundation. They could be they could be moving, traveling. I also feel like somebody's ships are coming in. Okay, something is coming in that that there's been some sort of delays. It's definitely time. It's time to Stop playing games. It's time to embark on a new journey. And a definite decision is being made. There's a new passion. There's a new drive. There's a new vision. It's actually pretty exciting. Somebody's made up their mind. And they're ready. This is ready. Get prepared. Get prepared. There is victory here after, I gotta say, maybe something gets exposed or somebody admits something. Good luck. 